Alright, is it love? Let's see. We have the King of Pentacles, which is a prosperous person. Could be responsible, the head of the family, or dominant. We have the Queen of Wands with strength and feeling drawn to somebody, a creative person. Then we have the justice in reverse. Justice in reverse is not fair treatment and there could be no karmic setting here. But I do feel like it could be a karmic tie where there has to be a lesson learned here or some type of eureka moment on what you want in your life. I feel like somebody's kind of putting that out on the back burner. But anyway... So, you is for whomever this uh, resonates for. Um, setting romantic goals, making plans in love, planning for a future together. And then we have them. We have a new relationship. We have a fun, light, romantic relationship. And we have the potential connection. Is a new ro romance, a friendship, next level in a relationship, deeper intimacy. And then there's taking a chance in a new place, a creative decision. We have choosing love, following your heart. We have someone completely new and previously unknown. So, this person is totally anonymous. Um, <laughs> so, just a word of caution. I've read a couple creepypastas that talk about missing persons or the incredible clones of this time and day and age that we're in now. Usually they are here temporarily. They could be spies. Um, so just, just be wary of that. But um, yeah, usually if somebody's like a no name that like comes up, it's, it's a bit of a problem. I mean, it draws a lot of attention um, to the wrong sort. So just be aware of that. And um, they're there for a purpose. I wouldn't, I wouldn't let, let that fool you. But um, yeah, it could be a bit of a problem later down the road if something doesn't go off without a hitch, if you know what I mean. Anyway, I will see you in the next reading. Take care of yourselves. Take care of everyone. And I will see you in the next reading. All right. Later.